before we get to Tuesday, are you? Sure, okay. I will. Well, speaking of Halloween, it is less than a week away, but some people say the ghosts and the goblins are already here. New at 11, Greg Greenberg shows us how some real-life Ghostbusters are going after them. Come again, come again. Real calls from a ghost the ghost hunters claim they caught on tape. A lot of times they're whispery. It's hard to hear what they're saying. But for the most part, they sound just like someone talking. This is no haunted house. It's a real life ghost hunt at the Fort Myers History Museum. These people have $10,000 worth of high tech equipment. Inside the train, there are investigators listening for noise. What are they a few feet away inside the museum, these guys monitor computers connected to cameras that are meant to catch An incredible amount of people that we talk to have stories of their own. And then once in a while, you'll get somebody to say, you're crazy. <laughs> One ghost hunter says something this. threw this table at her. And honey, Archie swears she saw a spirit at a cemetery. A very tall man walking. Another time, she says one touched her. It like skin, like pressure, skin, like a person touching you. So it feels like they have flesh touching you? Yes, for the most part, yes. You ever think it could just be another person? Nobody's there. The ghost hunters search for spirits all across Southwest Florida almost every week and all through the night. They say sometimes they get lucky. They get serious? Yes, very serious. Other times they hear something. <laughs> but it's not always English. Sometimes you get foreign languages and you don't understand what they're saying. The ghost hunters will keep listening and looking for spirits from beyond. Grant Greenberg, Wink News. Well, the ghost hunters admit there's no scientific way to prove that there are ghosts, but that doesn't stop them. Actually, groups like this all over the country. And if you'd like to learn more about the group or the ghosts, we put a link on our website. Go to winktv.com. Clayton's here, and of course, at 6 o'clock, you had a little painting.